Okay, guys, how's it going? Welcome back to more Let's Play 007 Nightfire Blind for the PlayStation 2. This is part 2, the last part we did the tutorial, and now we're going to start the main game. So let's start our 007 adventure. So in the last part I created a code name, Bond. So go with that. Now we've got difficulty setting guys, we've got operative, which is for trainee agents. And there are fewer, weaker and deal less damage. In-game hints are provided. Oh, that sounds like a breeze. Agent for skilled agents. Enemies have their usual characteristics and do standard damage to you. It's medium difficulty. And we have the double agent. For double agents only, enemies are tougher, deadlier and more numerous. So uh, not will be too difficult and probably frustrating probably for a let's play. So we're just going to go middle for middle. Agent. And uh, yeah, we're on next change. Let's see how many. Nah, there's not too many missions. I do hear it's quite a short game, so. And anyway, guys, yeah, the exchange. Drop in on Raphael Drake's reception and a rendezvous with undercover agents. Go for it. What a board deploy, miss. Oh, cutscene. Good evening, 007. A redesigned piece of missile guidance hardware intended for the orbiting U.S. space weapons platform has been stolen. Oh, NATO has no. advised that recovery is critical. Should an unfriendly power reverse engineer this device, the platform's global defense capabilities would be severely compromised. Mm. Recent intelligence implicates Raphael Drake in the theft. Hard to believe, as Drake is a respected green industrialist. As Phoenix International dismantles obsolete atomic reactors and decommissions nuclear arsenals. An allied agent planted in Drake's organization reports that Alexander Mayhew, a British expatriate who heads Phoenix's Japanese branch, is en route to Drake's castle in Austria. The stolen guidance device will change hands tonight during a formal gathering at the castle. Hmm. So, oops. My tongue on music. Great. I'm get too excited. No. As a W agent, you may have to answer aggression with aggression. Good luck, Bond. I've got to say something. Oh, it's skydiving. Boom, 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 ba da 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 Woof. Oh no, it's not guard dogs, is it? Okay, let's see what we can do. Breach the castle walls. If you are having trouble completing any objective, go. Uh, you can get a hint on the pause menu. So, uh, this actually looks quite good for uh, a PS2 game. So, we've got a gun. That's our aimer. So, let's go for it. Let's go for it. Oh god, it's going to feel weird. So you can control with the left analog stick and you move up and down with the right analog stick. I might take a bit of getting used to. But hopefully we can get used to it quickly. Boom! Aha! Oh! Alright, oh, um... Oh, it's X. Okay. X to reload, which is kind of annoying. I like square to be my reload button. So square takes off and puts on the silencer. The suppressor. So I want it to be silent. Uh, want a silent. What's that? Picked up a sniper. Yeah, I'm guessing. How do you change weapons? There's a stunner. A laser. A grapple. A micro camera. Uh, okay. Stunner. Micro camera. Ah, there we go. So you press up and down on the directional button to change weapons, so we've got the sniper rifle. Take it, this is a silencer. It's got a silencer on it. So I'm going to aim. And I'm going to fire. Boom! And, uh, shoot that crap out. Oh, we've been spotted. Ha, <laughs> get wrecked. Uh, I'll swap back to the pistol, I think. So you can't you can't move and shoot, which is gonna take a bit of getting used to. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, I've got machine gun now. It's more like it. 
or assault the rifle, whatever you want to call it. Can we go down there? It's probably not the best of ideas. Ha! Huh, get down. Do, 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 do. Oh, flipping hell! It's not a horror game, but that bloody scared me. Oh, shit. Uh, action button. That's X, isn't it? Yeah, I thought so. This feels like a pretty damn good and uh, a pretty solid first person shooter. I'm going to enjoy this, guys. Yeah, I really am. I'd say the best Bond game on the PS2 was probably... Probably Agent Under Fire. I've not played too many Bond games. Well, I've not completed many Bond games, sorry, on the PS2. Completed from Russia with Love, completed Agent Under Fire. I've got this game and I've got everything or nothing, but I've not played much of this, or everything or nothing. So, um, yeah. Well, my favourite Bond game of all time is probably the PS, probably the PS1 game, Tomorrow Never Dies. Oh, it was a great game. Which I've also let's put on this channel. Uh, second favourite is probably Quantum Solace on PS3. I loved that game, you know. Felt like Call of Duty, but in, you know, James Bond world. Ha, <laughs> ah, you didn't see that coming. <laughs> Uh, oh! <laughs> oh, you're kidding! That was a, that was a bloody civilian, wasn't it? Oops! I thought I thought it was too good to be true. <laughs> oh, I thought it was a bad guy. Oh, right back to the beginning of the live one, guessing. So about that, guys. Oh, poor. Oh no, we're here. Oh, that's good. Game gives you checkpoints. That's pretty generous of it, isn't it? Pretty generous game. Right, let's try this again. Uh, try this way. Gotcha. He looks like a bloody farmer or a shepherd. He's got that kind of clothing on. Just gonna sit there. Okay, no funk me or anything. Fair enough. Let's see what's down here. Oh, this reminds me of blood. Uh oh. This reminds me of Meadow Runner Underground. This area. Oh crap. Ha, <laughs> get wrecked. Oh, this ammo wears out quite quick. Oh, there you go, that's tons of ammo. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. So there's what? There's no point of coming down here. There must be a switch or something. Ruin, no other point of coming down here. Just to shoot a few people and get some ammo. I suppose it's worth it for the ammo. So, um, yeah, you just hang around. I'll put a coat on, man. You might catch your death of cold. Uh, nothing down there, is it? Alright. Uh, Here, I guess. Oh, the well. It reminds me of a joke that I once heard. This man said to the audience, he says, Are you all well? And of course the crowd went, Yes! And he said, No, you're not a well, you're a person. <laughs> yeah, it's one of those bad jokes, but he's kind of up the laugh at it. It was quite funny. Oh. Saw so, ya. Yeah. Oh crap! Kick that door open. Like an absolute boss. I'm gonna kick this door down. So, armor, I guess that was. So press a press action to do something. Oh, what's that? Is that a switch? Oh. Um. Okay. Uh, stunner. No. A laser. Ha ha ha. I look. Oh. Oh, I wasn't meant to do... Oh, sugar. Um, I wasn't supposed to... Oh, and you... No. What am I doing, guys? Should I not know by now that red's always bad? It's danger. What do I do? Cut the bloody red wire first. I'd be bad at bombing bomb disposal, I'll tell you guys. Just cut all the bad wires. Oh, that's... I'm gonna have to turn that down. Bloody klaxon, man. It's loud. 
for the claxon. Oh, I don't know where I'm going. Oh, I'm going right. Oh, crap. Okay. Take cover. Holy crap. I know it's our old days, guys, but this game feels really, really fun. I'm enjoying this so far. You can say it's early days. Crap, I'm about dead. Oh, I've got to be the worst 007 Nightfire player ever. Oh! Oh, look at that, what a shot. Crap. Stop shooting your guns at me, please. I thought someone was shooting me, but I don't see them, so let's just ignore that. Oh, what the quacks, and I wish it would shut up. It's one of the most annoying sounds in the world, man. It's a klaxon. Or alarm, what do you want to call it? I always call them bloody klaxons. But it's, oh, it's really an alarm, isn't it? Not a klaxon. Bloody klaxon. Oh, we're back here again. Uh, up. Oh, crap. Uh, up here, I guess. Not really sure where else we can go. Oh, there's a guy around here. I saw him. Here we go. Saw him at the corner of my eye. My eye. Hello. I'm around. Where the hell are we going, guys? Have we been down there? No, we've not. It's all my days. Holy crap. Um, oh, I thought, I thought I killed him. Is that, oh, is that a different dude? Shooting him, but he's not dying. Now he's dead. I like it when I shoot them and they die. That's what's supposed to happen. Oh, no. Oh, I'm in danger, guys. Uh, open door, yeah, why not? Stay away to doom. Oh, I'm in here. Oh, wonder who's in here. Hmm, nobody, I guess. Oh, this is too good to be true. Oh, it's locked. Great. It's exactly what I wanted to see. But they locked doors. This one better be open. Right, so it's, what's the point of coming up here then? Oh, this game's not going to be like a maze, is it? You've got to like, figure out where you're going. Well, I think that, oh, I don't know. It's kind of pointless that, but <laughs> I don't know. Maybe there is some meaning to it. Do the barrels explode? Oh, look at that guy's exploded. Wow, boom. Oh dear. There's a guy up there. Not two of them actually. <laughs> actually, oh my god. What the hell's that? Oil. Oh crap. Yeah, that was with the bloody explosive barrels, wasn't it? What the hell's this chimney? Oh, it's a locked door. Yes, the barrels exploded. <laughs> Told about that. Barrels of oil. Right? Yeah. Nope. <laughs> oh, he's got his suit on now. Did it, did it, banana. Is it end of the mission? 
Oh, maybe not. I was going to say that's perfect, but I don't think it's over yet. Is it? No, I think we won't. Yeah, it's more. The guests won't take kindly to fire arms. Keep them hidden to maintain a low profile. Oh, okay. No guns on me. Bano! Oh, hello! Pretty ladies. Pretty ladies. Pretty ladies. Hello. Oh, oh, she looked at me. Oh, they're both looking at me. Ah, hello. Think you're attacking me now. I've, got, I've not got a gun in my pocket. <laughs> I'm just uh, you know, an innocent person here. I'm not going to shoot anybody. For now. Oh my god, I wouldn't get it right. Oh my god. I wouldn't get like to get on the wrong side of him. Look at his bloody arms, like tree trunks. Nice place you've got here. Really, it's beautiful. Oh, hello. I'm not getting through there. I'm not messing with bloody bodyguards. Yo. Hello. Hello. You'd better return to the parties. Okay, party is this way. Da, 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 da. Ba, 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 ba. Open. Oh god, so we're right in here. Thank you all for accepting my invitation this evening. Your generous gifts have ensured the success of our World Refugee Fund. Uh, hello. Once again, my gratitude to all for making the journey here. And now, cocktails are waiting for you in the salon. I have business to attend to. Please, the hostess, won't you, darling? That room's so red. Oops. That room's so red. Yeah, let's go, I guess. Boom, 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 boom. Is that lava? I don't know. Can we go through here now? No party guests in here, sir. Right, no, nothing here. Oh. Right, okay. Now where do we go? Just back the way we came. Oh, here we go. James. James. Oh. Uh oh. You're the deep cover agent. It's not as deep as it looks. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt your debriefing, 007. Your party. Agent Nightshade, CIA. Dominique Paradis. French intelligence. Agent Nightshade. May has arrived with the stolen guidance device. Drake just went to the conference room. I would imagine he's meeting Mayhew there. Take this key. You won't get far without it. I better get back to the party before I am missed. MI6 wants surveillance photos of that exchange. Right. I'll create a distraction for you while you make your way to the conference room. Is that dress standard company issue, Nachi? <laughs> Don't get any ideas, 007. It's armored in all the right places. Alright. She's been very alluring. You know why? Bond, don't let Drake's men get in your way. Use whatever means necessary to get to that meeting. But guys, I'm afraid I'm going to have to end it there, we're almost at 20 minutes, so hope you've enjoyed this part guys, and I will catch you all in the next video. See you guys, thanks for watching.